It's been over 24 hours since Donald Trump became the president-elect of the United States. And on Thursday, he and wife Melania will meet with Barack and Michelle Obama at the White House. We've learned that women can be anything except for president. Already the social commentary is flying in, and NBC has opted to pull a Trump-inspired episode of Law & Order SVU. Of course, celebrities still have a lot to say about the results of the election, too. From those who supported Trump, including Kirstie Alley and Stephen Baldwin. If you agree or not, the cool thing to do is really give Mr. Trump the opportunity. To those who didn't, like Rosie O'Donnell, George R.R. R. Martin, and Chelsea Handler. I guess the message that I want to, like, spread out to other women is, is exactly what you're saying, is not to give up. Sorry, I hate crying on camera, but is not to give up because this is so important. While there are tears, there also seems to be a strong message of hope out there from Hillary supporters. My job is to be hopeful and to make everybody feel good, and I am going to keep doing that for as long as I can. John Legend shared this sweet family photo asking for love and empathy. Aaron Sorkin penned an emotional letter to his daughters in Vanity Fair, telling them to fight for what they believe in. And Jennifer Lawrence wrote an essay for Broadly encouraging others to educate themselves on the issues that matter to them moving forward. Amy Schumer vowed to stay in the USA, despite joking she would leave. And Katy Perry even revealed her parents voted for Trump. But quote, we will all still be sitting at the same table for Thanksgiving. And in this is the moment we need to remember that we all love our parents and we all love our children.